To say I'm excited is an understatement. Today, we have a very, very extremely special unboxing. My custom from the almighty goat company of Whoop. Now initially, to make this video, I was gonna try to track it with the USPS tracking, but they never put when it was out for delivery and things like that, so I didn't end up getting the shots that I wanted to get. They delivered it at around like 6 p.m. yesterday to my mailbox, which is like the latest they've ever delivered anything to me, so I would've filmed this last night if I would've known, but I had no idea, so my mom just gave this to me just now. This is early in the morning, so if I look like I'm still dead inside, it's because I am. <laughs> I haven't woken up all the way yet, but I need to knock this out right out of the way because Zach from Wova said that he doesn't like when decks sit in the packaging too long. So, that must mean it's something special. I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. We're gonna get into this thing. Oh my God, I'm so excited. Ooh, I need some scissors. <laughs> oh gosh. Mr. Zach McWobe. So if you know anything about Wobe, you know that they're very prestigious in their deck making. A lot of time goes into each individual deck to make sure that it's perfect. Okay, let's snip it. Here we go. I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. Maybe, is there a note in here? Please be a note. Okay, okay, okay. We're just gonna slip it out. Okay. Yo, Jeremy. What's up, YouTube? <laughs> the smallest, cutest little note. All right, oh, I kind of got a sneak peek. I kind of got a sneak peek just now. Okay, okay, okay. I can't tell you how hyped I am for this. Yes, yes. He hooked it up with some wool vinyls. Thank you, Jeezy's. Look at these. So cute, nice. In these DM conversations, about a day ago, he told me. You may or may not want to use this deck. It's that beautiful. Here we go. Let's little, get all these little unwrappings. Oh my god, no way! Do not tell me. Do not tell me there are two decks here. I swear to god, if you tell me there's two decks here, I'm gonna murder myself. I'm actually gonna murder myself. I don't know what that is! I don't know what- Why are there two? Why are there two? Why? I didn't pay for two. Oh my god. Oh, there's so many decisions to be made right now. Okay, we're just gonna go with the one on top first. I found a note. Just in case you don't want to shred the muffin. So this is just a different deck while this is the special deck. Okay, okay, that makes a lot of sense. Let's go, let's go with the not so special deck right off the bat. It's an exotic ply. It still looks really, really good. Oh my god, dude, two whoops. What am I gonna do with two whoops? Just in case I don't wanna shred the muffin. Oh, I can't believe you did this. I can't believe you freaking did this. Oh, I hate you. Here's the one. Open last, see? I didn't even read it, but I know. I know, open last. I know! I know, Zach! I know. This is the one we've all been waiting for. This is the one. I'm gonna take my time opening this. Gonna unravel it real slow. Okay. Here we go. Oh! Okay! Here we go, boys. Are y'all ready? Alright. Oh. My. God. You have to be kidding me. One of a kind, never ever gonna make ever again a muffin whoop. Who else has a muffin whoop than your boy? Woo! Let's go! And a split ply on top with the white whoop. Oh my god, dude. This is all I've ever wanted in life. This is literally all I've ever wanted in life. Oh my god. I love it on the flat white background too. That's the most beautiful thing I've ever seen in my life. Cozy shape, of course. Look how beautiful that top ply is. Black middle ply, two-tone top ply. Oh my god, counter sinks look beautiful. Oh my god, dude, do I really want to set this up? Do I really want to use this? I don't know, I don't know. I don't know. Oh my god, Zach. 
Zach, you're putting me through some tough times to figure out if I want to use this or not. I'm probably just gonna end up setting this up because this is beautiful as well. Like, this is absolutely beautiful as well. Okay, guys, I set up the decks and this is actually like a week and a half in the future because I went to California for Sorry for Fingerboarding. Thank you for everyone who came up to me and said hi and asked for a picture, asked for an autograph. Thank y'all all for everybody who is nice out there. I love every single one of y'all out there, every fan. Even that little kid I made cry. All the California vlogs are coming after this video. They're gonna be separated by like two days. So there's gonna be like two days, Cali vlog, two days, Cali vlog, two days, Cali vlog. I'm gonna be on this big road trip for the next 10 days starting on Monday of next week. And I'm not gonna be able to edit any videos whatsoever. So I'm just making a bunch of videos in advance so that y'all will have some content while I'm gone. So. Today! Also guys, go make sure to check out Zach's YouTube channel. He puts out a lot of really high quality videos as well. He works hard on his stuff and he doesn't get enough recognition for it. So big shout out to his YouTube channel. I'm gonna have it in the card like right here. It's just gonna pop up from the side. I watch his videos every single time they drop and they're always super high quality with a lot of time spent on them. So make sure to go check out his channel if you're looking to see some awesome fingerboard videos as well. Here are the actual decks. I did kind of go crazy on this one. I um, put clear grip on top because I really wanted to try skate grip and I had a piece of clear grip and I really like the orange ply on here so I put clear grip on there. Had to put the orange sticker as well. This is a really solid deck. It's a little heavy for some reason. I think the skate grip makes it heavier. And here's the actual uh, muffin whoop. I'm, I'm kind of upset that I used it because I kind of wanted to frame it. But at the same time, this thing's just too cool to not use. I put oak bowls on it with uh, like some turquoise teak tuning and some gold based BRTs. And it's just such a beautiful setup. And not only that, but I had to include the little grip gap because it's two-tone on top. Like, that's beautiful. And just for the wub, y'all know I like the grip gaps. It's a little short of a grip gap, like, like the tail. Like, I end up placing my finger on the little gap quite often. But it's whatever, you know? That's how he does it with the O's, and I think that's really creative and awesome. But let me get into the review of both of these decks. I'm kind of just going to be reviewing the muffin one because this is the exact same deck, just no graphic. But the graphic wears beautifully on this deck. I know you can't really tell because my lighting is so bright, but there's some of the wear on the deck and then some of the wear on the actual muffin. It's hard to tell, but it does wear in very, very nicely and very, very evenly. It's not like one part is wearing a lot and the other parts aren't. This thing is very consistent and put on here. Another thing that I really, really love about the company Woob is that on their graphics, when he paints them on there, when he puts them on there, I really don't know his method, you can always see right on the edge a little bit of the bottom ply. And you can see that perimeter around the entire graphic and it's just that one little strip of orange. I just think that adds a cool little flare to it so you can actually see like your entire thing. That's what I love about the Wub as well. I feel like it's actually rounded on the side. Like you have a lot of decks that you'll get and they're not very rounded on the side. This is like a clear mountain with the middle ply being the furthest one sticking out. And it's just, it's just so beautiful what he does with them. I really like the way he shapes his decks. And I've never seen somebody sand them this uniform and perfect. Because it's the exact same way on this deck as well. And it's just beautiful. A lot of people just sand their decks to where they're just straight down. He actually gives them some curvature. Which makes it really cool when you're looking at the plies. Extremely, extremely cool. Talking about the plies, this deck is pressed very, very well. It is extremely lightweight and it has all the freaking pop for days. It pops perfectly, it rotates perfectly. The shape on this deck is probably one of my favorite shapes ever in fingerboarding, if not my favorite. He, he has really crafted one of the most ergonomically. 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 Relating to or designed for efficiency and comfort in the working environment. One of the most ergonomically sound shapes in fingerboarding, honestly. Just by giving it that beautiful concave that isn't too harsh, 
that flows perfectly with the kicks by giving it deep dips with that signature shape. Like, this thing is honestly such a well-crafted and well-thought-out deck. There's a lot of science that goes behind what is going to work for your fingers, and Wub has the secret recipe. He has the Krabby Patty secret formula out here, and uh, he's just running away with it <laughs> because this deck is insane, literally insane. I can't get over how well this deck performs. I've seen a lot of whoops before. This one is a little different with the shaping of the tail. I feel like it tapers a little bit, and it's not as round as uh, like the normal tails of whoops. See, like this one is extremely round, and then this one's a little skinnier. So it's like it tapers a little bit. I don't know if that's just me. I'm not against it. Like it works perfectly for me. I prefer a big fat wide tail and a big fat wide nose. I don't know why. Another thing that I wanted to talk about in this video, this video might be kind of long, I'm sorry guys, is I have the new Sponsor Me Tape formula on top. Add Sponsor Me Tape right here. He came out with a new formula and um, he sent me three pieces to try out. Unfortunately, I was gonna make a video completely separate for this. I lost the footage with all that other footage that I lost from Cali, the videos I needed to make. I still have the package right here from him. I still have the note directly from Jared. Right there. Sponsor Me Tape is available on New Era. It'll be in the description below. And he asked me to mention his video, We Like It. There's a post on his Instagram page. He's making a big collaborative video called We Like It. And he wants people to send in clips to him. I'll link that post from Instagram in the description as well. But all I can say about it, like I'll do a little quick review for it. All I can say about it is if you like FBS, if you like clean sheets, if you like good tape, this stuff is for you. This is literally my favorite tape. I have run out of sponsor me tape. I need to go buy some more because this stuff is the best stuff that I've ever tried. And I really, really like it. Like it's grippy, it's thin, and it's not sticky. One thing that I hate about tapes is when they're sticky. Like if you put your fingers on them, you lift your hand up and it follows your hand. This thing is not sticky at all. And that's what I love about this tape. It moves like in the slightest margin. But like if you press your fingers down, it doesn't even follow you that hard. This is like catfish barbecue tape, which is also really good. If I press my fingers down on that, my hand up, see how it kind of goes fine? That's because it's a little too sticky for me. It's still great tape, but not as good as sponsor me tape. Go check that out, all this stuff in the description. Back to the deck review. Perfect shape, perfect roundness. Just the attention to detail is what makes these literally some of the rarest decks on the market. And if y'all don't know about Wub, they're extremely hard to get. And that's because they're always custom orders and they're always going to be directly through Zach. If you get one, you know, through somebody else, they're probably going to charge you a fortune. That's just how rare they are. I always suggest y'all get them through Zach. And that's the way he prefers as well, because he loves making wolves directly for people and them enjoying them and them experiencing them and them wanting to keep them forever because that's just how much they love them, you know? And this is something that will never leave my side, will never leave my hands because I just appreciate how much time he put into this thing. And it's a masterpiece. That's all I can say. This, this deck is literally a masterpiece. Another thing that uh, I really like about this deck is that I feel like I can do Nolly Heels easier on it. I know I say this about every single freaking deck I try, but like, hear me out guys, okay? First try, Nolly Heel, you got to like the video, okay? First try, Nolly Heel, you gotta like the video. Here we go. No! Ugh! Second try. Second try? You know what that means? Two likes on the video. Create another account and like it. You can't get better than a two-tone on top, natural black, natural orange, and then a beautiful muffin on the bottom. Who else has this muffin? Nobody. I'm the only one ever. If you request this, they'll be like, nah, that was one for Chuck Muffin. And that's all there will ever be. And I'm excited. And I want to kiss it. Mwah. Yeah, that was kind of weird. I really appreciate y'all watching this video. And I'd really appreciate if y'all check out Zach at ZMWoop right here. Go follow him. Go check him out. 
His site will be down here too. I'm not sure if he's taking custom requests right now, but you can always hit him up in his DMs. Try to talk to him a little bit. Don't ask for a free deck because you're not going to get one. Like, let's be honest, guys. You can't be just giving these away for free. What are you, crazy? Sorry for fingerboarding vlogs. Coming soon. I'll see y'all in a while because I'll be on vacation. I'm doing a lot of editing in these next couple days. I love y'all. I'll see y'all later. Wait. I completely forgot about the opal, guys. I'm going to be giving away because of 10,000 followers on Instagram. If you don't follow me on Instagram, go follow me at ChubbyMuffinFB. If you don't subscribe to me, just, just go subscribe to me. Um, that'd be great. And then all you need to do is comment at the bottom your favorite pastry. And I'm talking like cupcakes, muffins, like, you know, croissants, anything. I don't care. Comment your favorite pastry and you have a chance of winning this game. So, thank y'all again for watching this video. I will end it now because it has been quite long.